Well, there are very few avocados in this tree. This is this beautiful tree that has these big round avocados and they're really good. It's not really known what this variety is, but I was here last year and this thing was absolutely loaded. As you can see, there's a couple avocados up there. Nothing like last year. It was a bounty last year. So why is that? Well, I really think that most of these, well, maybe I shouldn't say most. I don't really know, truthfully. But it seems like a lot of these trees, when you have a big old bounty of fruit one year, they just want to take the next year off. Often, it's oftentimes the case. It's not often you get big year after big year after big year with these avocado trees. So you should expect that. But look, there's hardly, I don't see anything down low. This thing was just loaded heavy last year. They're just sporadically up in the tree. And I'm in prime avocado growing environment here. So anyway, um, just wanted to tell you that sometimes you just gotta expect an off year. It's another reason to get multiple trees and you have multiple chances of bumper crops in any given year. The whole idea is to have a nice steady stream of avocados every year, all year long. Get some uh, different varieties that uh, fruit in different times of the year. Get redundancy to that. Maybe as many trees as you possibly could fit in your property. And um, then you should uh, be eating guacamole more than uh, most people you know. And that's it.